So no one likes having to buy a new printer in 2025, but it's actually pretty easy to set up once you get one. I just got a brand new Brother L2460DW because my old printer broke and here's how you set it up. Put the printer in place and the first thing you wanna do is remove all the tape. There'll be some here stopping this thing from moving around, a little bit here stopping that from opening. Just get that removed and you can move on to the next step. Then you wanna get ahead and get this bag right here. This is the toner cartridge. This has to get inserted into the printer and you wanna do so somewhat carefully because the cartridges are fairly expensive and they're a little bit sensitive. First thing you need to do is to open up this front door. And that's not this door right here, it's the full door, which you do from the sides. Now, take this thing out of the bag. There's a little indentation right here on the corner where you can tear it open. That's what it looks like. And this is the way it's going to go in like this. This orange thing on the side, this is sort of protecting the sensitive parts while it's in transit. This just gets removed. Just kind of pull it. Carefully pop it off. And this orange piece gets discarded. Now, with the brother, that text reading up or reading normally, slide it in and kind of just pop this in place. It should kind of click in place just like that, and it should feel nice and firm in there. Then you just go ahead and shut this door. It should shut easily with no sort of like interruptions or anything feeling like you have to force it. Next up, we're going to load the paper. We have just standard eight and a half by 11 paper here. And you're gonna pull this door open on the bottom. This tray right here is gonna look a little wonky. It's too small for standard paper. Just push this green tab and pull it open till it's the size you want. This too will be too far in. Just move it back. Now you're gonna get that paper. Try to flatten it out a little bit and push it in place here. If there's not enough room for it, flatten everything out and now push this piece up. So these are nice and snug against your paper. It doesn't have to be super tight, it just has to be snug. Now lift that a little bit to get past the little foot thing there and push this in place till it clicks. You could remove any of these stickers at any time. These are not necessary, obviously, but you may want to leave them in place until you have the printer running and you can make sure it's compatible with your machines. Now you want to plug the printer in. Brother includes a printer cable, but this is a standard cable, so you could probably use the old one from your last printer if you want, or just use the new one. The printer plugs into the back right-hand corner of the printer. It's pretty easy to do. Just plug it in and now, and just plug this into the wall like you normally would. At this point, you can press the power button. Your Wi-Fi light will turn on. The printer will make some printer noises and you're pretty much ready to go at that stage. At this point, you can change the language of your printer if you need. It's preset to English. So if you're watching this video, you're probably okay. And now the steps are gonna vary based on how you wanna use your printer. You could use the little QR code to get it set up on your laptop, you can just plug it in. It'll work with pretty much any modern Windows or Mac computer, or you can get it set up with your smartphone or your tablet, whatever, just by using that QR code, installing an app, and you're good to go. You may have to play around a little bit with the Wi-Fi setting, but that's all pretty simple, and it'll happen through that app installation process. Again, you could just use a USB cable, plug that in, and you'll be good to go in seconds. But yeah. That's how you set up your brother L2460DW laser printer. Thanks for watching.